What's good, Horror Horde? This is your boy, Horror Gamer, letting you know I got a surprise for you. Stay tuned, stick around. See you in a bit. What is good, Horror Horde? This is your boy, Horror Gamer, back with another video for you. And as you can tell by the title of this video, your boy might be making a mistake, but um, as you see, we are not in Horror Haven. We're not in the safety of Horror Haven. Earlier this month, I promised you guys that we were going to take a little trip and I'm a man of my word and uh, so I decided today would be the best day to revisit sorry revisit something and it's been 20 years since I've been here because the last time I was here it didn't go well and um I'm outside of the walls right now, but as you can see in the title, this is your boy Horror Gamer's return to Hans Groff. Uh, I will not be going inside. Uh, it's the middle of the day because I think uh, it's a little safer to be here. Like, you don't understand, like right now, your boy Horror Gamer is terrified to be here. I don't want to be here, um, but I promised you guys that I would show you the infamous cemetery. I've been driving for a while now, and I decided it's time to come back, and it's time to show you guys the cemetery that beat your boy. And like I said, I won't be, I will not be stepping foot in there because I learned my lesson 20 years ago. But this is the first time. In 20 years, it's your boy Horror Gamer. I revisited Hans Groff. So with all that being said, Horror Horde, this is the official return to Hans Groff. All right, guys, as you can see, there it is. There's the cemetery that we made the mistake of going into when I was younger and got cursed so this time around your boy hard gamer staying on the outside of the wall but as you can see there is the wall no gates that's because this is supposed to be be cursed land and as long as you're outside of the wall should be okay so we'll go up a little closer and take a look as you can see it has the creepy graveyard look to it and there's so many stories about this graveyard and um, you know my girlfriend was actually telling me that there was a story when she was younger that if you walk the and I've heard this too if you walk the perimeter of Hans Groth and you walk it a certain way at night there's supposed to be a wolf guardian a werewolf guardian that keeps eye over this cemetery at night and you can summon him by doing a specific route around this wall but as you can see there's no gates there's nothing they don't want you here and you know I'm staying on the side of the wall because I don't need the spirits following me home but this place ruined my childhood there it is girl would also tell me stories where she used to live on the other side of this wall um, in a different area because there's a little there's a little township a couple blocks away at nighttime she would hear howling coming from the cemetery so yeah I'll never forget that night and if you don't know the story my story of Hans Groff Go check out True Ghost Stories with Horror Gamer and see the terrifying backlash I got from 
entering this wall. But as you can see, it's just private cemetery that's said to be cursed by witches. So I don't know. I, I believe enough not to go back in, but there it is, guys. Hans Groff, the infamous Hans Groff. And as you can see, the wall goes completely around. No gates, no nothing. So horror horde. This has been very scary for me. I still don't feel right <clears throat> being near this cemetery, but I promised you guys that I would bring you here and show you the infamous Hans Groff. And like I said, I still have the chills. It's still bothers me to be here and you know I'm so nervous it's a cool fall day so it definitely catches like the atmosphere but horror horde I think now that I brought you guys back to Hans Groff and I came back after 20 years I think it's time to finally let the spirits and everything of Hans Groff rest and put this place behind me for good um now that i've closed this chapter and finally have refaced the foe um it's still a daunting sight for me it's definitely still a daunting sight and i just i don't know everything in me is telling me to run but I want to show you guys exactly what Hans Groth is. Just a little tiny cemetery protected by a wall in the middle of the woods. Definitely nightmare fuel. Definitely some nightmare fuel. But as you can see, this is about as close as I'm getting to going near the wall. Because whatever spirits that haunt Hans Groth, they need to stay on that side of the wall. So... All right, Horror Horde, I hope you enjoyed this little video, and I hope you enjoyed the return to Hans Groth. And let's just hope that nothing follows your boy home. But, you know, it doesn't look like much, but the stories behind this place said to be cursed by witches protected by a, a werewolf demon at night this is the wall that my buddy fell over and he fell straight down I'll, I'll never forget that night guys that night is definitely etched in my mind forever but there you guys go I wanted to bring you guys here like I said it's time for me to put this chapter of my life behind me for good I'll be happy if I never see this place again. So, but, all right, Horror Horde, there it is. There is the infamous Hans Groff Cemetery. And let me just give you a little wide shot of how big it really is. It is not that big of a cemetery at all. There it is. That's, that's the gist of it. A creepy little cemetery in the middle of nowhere. All right, Horror Horde. Next time you see me, it's going to be driving as fast as I can to get away from this place. There it is, one last look. Now it's time to put this place in my rear views forever. Hans Groff. All right, Horror Horde. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Like I said, it, it took a lot for me to come here, but I did promise you guys I would revisit Hans Groff. Um, as you can see, doesn't seem like much, but in the gist of things, it's a terrifying place. And, um, like I said, it took your boy 
20 years to come back. And I still, like, I don't feel right being here. I'm getting ready to leave now. Um, but, yeah, the stories and everything and just everything about this place gives your boy horror game of the creeps. And the reason I came during the day, for one, the road that it's on is very dangerous. Um, and for two, uh, it took everything for me to come, period. And you could see it better during the day. But... <clears throat> I just, I don't know if I could have done this at night because the last, um, the last experience I had with Hans Groff at nighttime wasn't a good one. And I have a lot of things going on right now in my life and I just don't need the curse of Hans Groff to come back at me. Um, as you can see, I am very nervous because I believe that this, this cemetery is actually truly cursed and like I said, I don't like being here. Um, as you can see, it's still I'm still here. I'm in the background. Um, I'm getting ready to leave now. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, keep a close look. See if you see anything. That's why I kept panning over. You know, just to see if we could pick something up. If you hear any noises. Um, but, you know, this cemetery for me is, it's terrifying. And like I said, I'm not really like liking to be here right now, but I did promise you guys I would come back and I faced the fear and I came back, but um, I'm glad I did, but I am ready to get the hell out of here. Um, so I really hope you enjoyed this video, Horror Horde. I love you guys. Thank you. Don't forget, it's still Horror Horde Appreciation Month, so get your request in so your boy Horror Gamer can get it done for you. Even if it goes all the way to November, I got you. Um, <clears throat> if you haven't yet, be sure, hit that subscribe button, along with that dingly ding ding button. That way every time your boy Hard Gamer throws up a video like this that you're in the know. And also, November 12th is the cutoff for the Friday the 13th box set giveaway. Get your entries in. Go into the previous videos and look up the 1,000 subscriber giveaway contest and all the rules you need are there. And also, head on over to the Z Network. A bunch of us got together created something i think is going to be epic and um it's something for everybody so with all that being said horror horde i love you guys thank you i'm getting the hell out of here because i'm still very uncomfortable with where i'm at right now but um i'm getting the hell out of here uh and until next time this is your boy horror gamer saying as always don't fear the darkness embrace it